know if you ought to hear me, this thing's very loud. What's going on yesterday? That's how are you? Is that better? Is it better to use this one than the other one? As far as audio inputs? What's going on, Ron? How you doing, brother? Welcome to the stream. Hey, Timmy Luke, what's up? So, can you guys hear me better with this one? Okay. Alright, I'll use the, uh, the other mic then. But yeah, this thing is really, really loud. But they're training going in and out of, of windows and uh, rescuing in and out of windows. 
right now. Hey, Jay Clark. Oh yeah, I went in it earlier, AJ. I've got some pictures. I'll post some pictures up too, but I got some pictures inside. What's up, Matthew? How you doing, brother? Welcome to the stream, Sideways. What's up? Good to see you. I don't know if y'all will be able to see it on here, but see, I got I got some pictures with my other camera. It's like the flashover up. That's up on the ceiling. It's pretty badass. Hey, Crystal, what's going on? Good to see you. Brooklyn, what is up? No, I'm not in Huntsville tonight. I'm out in Ardmore, right at the state line. Ardmore straddles both sides, both states. Good to see you too, Ron. Good to see you too. I think they're gonna rotate around to the other side here in a minute. Yeah, that's great. What's up, Taylor? I may move a little further back just because of the sound. But it shouldn't be as bad on the Yeah. So y'all gonna be using that doorway there? Yeah, we're gonna be burning that. Okay, cool. All right. All right, guys. They're swapping. Uh, they're swapping trainings. We're gonna go on the other side. Um, quite a while, I think. They've, uh, they've actually been doing it all week. I didn't realize it was out here. I just got lucky and passed by and saw it and asked if I could take pictures and they invited me to stay in video. Oh yeah, there we go. A lot quieter now, isn't it? Let's get, I'm gonna get over here. Oh, this is the, uh, this is the Ardmore Police Department, by the way. It's right across from the, uh, from the fire department. So I'm gonna try to position so that that light's not blinding me there. I think that'll work. I've also got to reposition my my tripod legs because I was on an unlevel side over there. There we go. But yeah, they've been uh, they've been doing this all week. Now they're going to actually be burning the inside of that trailer. Adam's doing good, Nicholas. He's doing good. I just didn't get back to Huntsville after I finished serving papers. Uh, they're doing training, so they're gonna they're gonna set the inside of that trailer on fire, and they'll go in there and practice moving through a burning building and stuff. Look at it! Look at it! Oh my God!
Look at that, y'all. You're not okay? Taylor, you'll be okay, brother. We love you anyway. What's up, Sophia? How you doing? Yeah, so they train in this, y'all. Hey, Stringer's Live, what is up? Yeah, we, I, we caught some training there, brother. Um, I doubt I'll do. I can't stay out too late, Nicholas, tonight because I got to pick my daughter up from work at uh at 10 o'clock yeah i got to look in there and stuff it's like it's metal on the inside of course so that it doesn't destroy the the trailer on the inside it's a real heat resistant metal but uh, it's pretty, it's pretty neat. Oh, you didn't sleep good last night, Taylor. I hate to hear that, brother. I do. I know it's rough when you don't get good sleep and then you got to work and all that. Yeah, yeah, it does. Said it gets about 600 degrees at the at the roof. No, it's just flames on top and stuff. The flames go around the top, and you gotta keep your wits about you and move around in there and stuff. Nothing flammable inside. Not in this one. This one's just got a couple of car doors they have to work through. See, it's got two doors. It's got an in and an out. That is a Crown Vic. Um, that is Giles County, Tennessee. Sheriff's Department. Vehicle right there. Yeah, no problem, Nicholas. We're not going to be too long tonight. I wasn't planning on streaming at all, actually. Um, I just saw this in the parking lot and stopped and asked if I could take pictures. They said, hell, hang around and get video of us training. So I was like, heck yeah. You don't get to see this all the time. So this is the, um, this trailer is funded by the uh, Alabama Fire College, right there, see? AlabamaFireCollege.org if y'all wanna donate to them. They have uh, three or four trailers that they move around. So they're getting it good and heated up now and then they will go in they'll start going in and, and uh, yeah they got they got an older one there's some newer ones back there too uh, but yeah that's an older one up front right there but they've got a pretty good sized fire department as you can see they got two uh, two buildings uh, one two three four five six seven eight bays I don't know if they're gonna pull any of them out or what what all they're gonna do I, they, I think they're gonna pump it they're gonna use that pumper See, that's a that's a tanker. But I've never gotten to see it, see training like this, so I figured I would stream it in case y'all wanted to watch too. Um, some are newer firefighters. Um, they're not necessarily um, recruits. They're actually working for various fire departments. I know there's one guy here from Huntsville. There's uh, the Ardmore Fire Department, Athens Fire Department. They use this for their newer, uh, their newer trainer. Uh, you know, the ones that are still training and learning. And then they they also use these for refreshers for folks. There goes the pass alarm going on. We'll, 
we'll reposition as we see how they're doing it. Looks like they're going to make entry on this side. But yeah, this isn't something you get to see all the time. Uh, well, the thing here, Brooklyn, um, there's a lot of rural areas out here that may not have fire hydrants. So I imagine that if they had to use that tanker, they would. Yeah, it gets up to like 600 degrees in there. It's filled with smoke right now. Hey, Andrew, checking what's going on. Thanks for coming over, brother. Okay, they're making entry now. No, this is uh, this is some training, South Powell. This is some training. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna reposition a little bit. I appreciate you coming over there, uh, Andrew, for sure. They're going to get ready to make entry. Yeah, they do it at night. Um, for some reason, I'm not sure why. I think it might add to the, to the possibility of disorientation to get them used to that. Oh, no idea, brother. I'm not sure how much it, it carries. Well, they're training right now, Nicholas. I'm not going to interrupt them there, brother. Let's let them do their thing. Yeah, I've, uh, I've had to do the stop, drop, and roll uh, stuff in school, too, but they... They just had like a, uh, a little thing that had smoke in it. This has actual flames. Yeah, I think that's what it's for there, uh, pizza. Hey, Dustin K, we're watching some, uh, some training. Um, the Alabama Fire College uh, trailer is in Ardmore, Alabama. So technically, I'm on the Alabama side of Ardmore. The uh, if you get you know, on Main Street in Ardmore, um, the side that I'm on, like here's Main Street right out there, right? There's Main Street. So on the other side of the double yellow line is Tennessee. This side that we're on is Alabama. Look how smoke filled that is. I have never seen anything like this, so I was super excited to be able to stop and and, uh, and stream it. Um, I talked to uh, talked to one of the guys from the Alabama Fire College, and uh, they may use some pieces of this video. Hopefully, it turns out good. Yep, that's why it says Alabama slash Tennessee. Sure is. Um, it's about 20 to 30 minutes to get home. All right, so there you go. They're getting low.
Yeah, it would. It would, Pete. It sure would. Hey, Excalibur, what's going on, brother? Oh, I did, Nicholas. I've been passing them out like candy over here. But I've never seen this training in progress. So I was super excited to be able to watch it. Welcome back, Andrew. Checking. But there's various fire departments represented here uh, going through this training. This was just by pure luck, y'all. I didn't even know it was here. You can see the flames through the crack there. You had to go through one of these, X? Oh yeah, it was South Park. It sure was. It was wild. Big thanks though to the Alabama Fire College and the uh, the Ardmore Fire Department for letting me sit here and film. Ah, sweet. That's awesome, X. Uh, all right. Good night, Kristen. Thanks for hanging out. hear the pass alarms beeping uh, well this this trailer has a thing in it that uh, that does the fire it's like a, a big um, I mean it's kind of shaped like a big fireplace on, on its own it's on this end down here back up in the in the back end uh, I did Jay I did last night Jay uh, Buddha would be Saturday oh I know it's South Paul that's basically what it was like Thank you, Dustin. I appreciate it. Hey, Sarnall, what's going on, brother? Good to see you. Oh, they're smoking it up good now. Look at that. So now that I'm at this angle, you can see they got a couple more trucks in here. See you later, Sophia. Thanks for hanging out. Later, Krista. I did, and I tried setting it. I'm not sure why it didn't load. I got some really good pictures though. Look at all that smoke billowing out. Yeah, yeah, I saw he was planning on doing something. I actually was planning on being back home for that. I just happened upon this. What's up, God then cowboys? Welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Oh, there's some flames. Y'all can see the flames now. Check it out.
Oh, dang, I hate to hear that. Oh, uh, God, then, Cowboys, I hope you're feeling better. Hey, Michael Tingley, what's up? Hey, Danny Southard, what's up? Good to meet you too, brother. We appreciate what y'all do. Hey, Doolin, what's up, brother? We may have to move if the police pull up because we're right in front of the police department. So if they bring somebody in, I uh, might have to move. I'm not going to get it on video not knowing what's going on. So. Law enforcement officers uh, in Alabama are not supposed to do perp walks. So I don't want to get that on video of them getting somebody out of the car here at the station. I don't want to get them in trouble. That is a big smoker. They smoking them firemen like crazy right now. Woo, that's hot up in there, y'all. They're pulling hose out now. Lewis, what's up, brother? Hey Joseph, what's up brother? Excalibur, international man of mystery. I may see if I can reprogram my scanner real quick while I'm out here, see if we can pick up Ardmore PD here in a little bit. Um, the last one you posted, uh, no, I didn't see that one. I saw the notification, I was out serving papers. I will go back and watch it though. I know it. I, they told me it gets up to 600 degrees up on the ceiling in there. That's hot.
brother Buddha what is up. Uh, we might can, uh, Nicholas. I'm not even sure if we can pick up their scanner traffic. Buddha, I got so lucky, man. I was, I was actually about to head home. I came up here just to listen to the scanner for a little bit and see if I could pick up their, their scanner traffic for Ardmore PD. And they had this set up in the parking lot. I asked if I could take pictures, and the fire department and the uh, the guy from the uh, Alabama Fire College said I could video it, stream it, whatever. Look at them flames in there, yo. Woo, I bet that's warm. Yeah, I hope y'all have a good stream tonight. I was planning on joining y'all. Um, and then, I, you know, like I said, I looked up on this. All right, Brooklyn, take it easy, brother. I'll catch your video tonight or tomorrow when I get home. I got to pick my daughter up from work at uh, 10 o'clock in uh, Huntsville, so I'm limited on how long I can stay anyway. The first part of the stream, they were doing uh, window rescues with the ladder. I caught that on video. Kia Sorrento 2022, what is going on? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, I think Buddha's going to stream from the server too. Um, no, I'm not really on duty necessarily, Lewis, because uh, like I say, I'm, I'm up against the clock to pick my daughter up. I'll stop if I see anything. What's going on, Ember? I've just never seen this training being done before and wanted to hop on and take a look at it. If I can pick up some scanner traffic from Ardmore PD, we might see what they're up to in a little bit. Sure will, Buddha. Have a good one, brother. That's awesome. We're going to hit 300. That would be nice. Oh, did we hit 300? Whoop, whoop. That's a new look for swipe being undercover. <laughs> What's going on, country? Good to see you, brother. 
Man, this thing is so neat. Woo, 300, that is so awesome. Thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. Yes, indeed. We're getting there. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. Yes, uh, well, this is actually a well, yeah, smoke trailer, burn trailer. Um, they actually have flames in this one. Um, you can kind of see it. They'll open the door every now and then, and you can see the flames. The flames are on this end, and then they, uh, they roll up along the ceiling. But they're, they're training on going in and coming in and out. How you doing, AJ Pants? All right, Amber, have a good night, ma'am. It's a uh, training trailer, uh, AJ. Hey, the cameraman, what's going on? Yeah, the, the flames on this one are intended to stay up high. They run along the ceiling. It's more, uh, it's more training with getting used to the heat, uh, flames above you, and uh, the smoke, of course. All right, Andrew. Have a good night, brother. Appreciate you chilling. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if they take them bits. Uh, no, AJ, it's just me. I actually wasn't planning on streaming tonight. I was just going to serve my legal papers and head back home and wait till time to pick up my daughter, but I couldn't pass up an opportunity to catch this training in progress. <laughs> no, Joseph. Man, I actually went up in this thing um, before they uh, before they kicked it all on. I wouldn't. My ass wasn't going up in there with no flames going or nothing like that. Uh, hell no. But uh, I stood at the door and got uh, got some pictures uh, when they start. The, so the flames start back here. There's kind of like this furnace thing back here at the back, and it uh, kicks the flames up to the ceiling. And I actually got a couple of pictures of that. He had to kick his feet. Pass alarm was sounding. Yeah, it's a live simulation chamber, basically, is what it is. So this one is uh, is the horizontal trailer. They have a uh, they had a vertical trailer uh, that they used. I didn't realize they were doing it, but they had it down in the Monrovia area, uh, like a tower trailer where you have to do like climbing rescues and stuff. I didn't get to see any of that. Yeah, I went in there before it before they lit it up. Not not on the live stream. That was before I set it up. I was just getting some pictures. Look at that. Look how disorienting that would be. Jesus Christ.
Yeah, those CS gas chambers aren't any fun either. You can freak out quick in one of those if you're not used to it. I know some people that's been in the military had to go through those. It's not running everywhere. Feel like you're gonna choke to death. What's going on, Chris Talbert? How you doing, brother? Uh, so the interior of this AJ is metal. There's nothing in there that's flammable. Um, that's basically a uh, gas created fire. So there's nothing in there that actually burns. Yeah, I don't blame you on that C CS gas. I wouldn't I wouldn't be near it either. GTR boy, what's going on? Whoop whoop. 300 subscribers, heck yeah. We on our way. A little bit at a time. Alright, I'm going to reposition around now that they're using that door. See if we can get us a... <laughs> that's what she said. Hey, that's right. I'm going to move down a little bit so we can get a, uh, a little better angle inside. That's the pass alarms, cameraman. If they stand still too long, they've got pass alarms that beep, and then that ringing is, uh, I think they're timing how long they're in there, and it'll ring when they get to that point. Yeah, GTR, it's a training session. No, this isn't their training yard. This trailer, they move this trailer around to different places. It just happens to be here this week. I just got lucky and was able to catch it. I don't know, South Pole. I don't know, brother. The MSDS. <laughs> Man, I don't want to know what I was in that. It actually smells rather clean, though. Of course, you can't trust your nose. But I'm sure there is a reason they got them air tanks on. You don't want to breathe that junk in.
train and help police sure is. Welcome to the stream there, buddy. Oh yeah, when uh, when they have houses that are going to be demolished and firefighters can train in a live situation like that, um, that's even better. Yeah, it is. It's something different, something I haven't ever seen before. Thought it was pretty sweet. Oh dang, that sounds rough, GTR. A basketball hoop go through his armpit? Oh my goodness, that sounds rough. Yeah, I did help police. They, uh, they told me I could hang out and film. Real cool guys, I tell you. Uh, those are pretty standard around here, AJ. Uh, that's just standard uniform. Um, I think um, I think Rank uses lighter helmets. Most everybody else uses darker helmets. Yeah, I think that's why they're doing it at night. Not to draw a whole bunch of people. They're practicing with water. You can see the water rolling out back here. Shut the roads down.
not sure if that's their last phase or if they're going to do something else. I think so too, Dustin. Oh, true, Joseph, true. I don't know if they ever do any of that or not. I know they've got at least three trailers, maybe four, that the Alabama Fire College moves around to different places for training all the time. I want to try to catch one of the vertical trailers where they're doing the uh, the multi-story rescue where they got to climb up through it and stuff. I mean, I will if I can catch it, AJ. Anything, you know, police, fire, and emergencies is what I'm trying to capture, so any of it I can get. Uh, this is multiple fire departments that send um, nearer folks to train on certain things. Um, so you've got, I know there's somebody from Huntsville Fire Department here. You've got uh, Ardmore Fire Department, Athens Fire Department. Um, not sure how many other departments are represented, but it's more than just this one fire department training right now. I think they're taking a break for right now. It looks like they're uh, they're going to be taking a break for a while. Um, although it's still running, it's still smoking. It's still heating up. I think they're going to do some uh, some smoke rescues. There they go, they're going in now. Um, yeah, that's the fire department right behind them there. I'm actually standing at the police department. The police department and the fire department share the same parking lot. So just to give you an idea, the, so the fire department, you can't see the end of it because um, it's behind the trailer there, but um, they've got four bays on this side and they've got four bays on this one.
they don't put dummies in there Lewis uh, they can't put anything flammable in this one um, if they do anything like that it'll be a live person sitting there um, with smoke they don't do rescue live, uh, like live rescues with fire they only do it with smoke I believe more PD. Big V, welcome to the stream, good to see you. making sure they weren't bringing anybody in but here's the Ardmore police cars those are pretty cool aren't they all right Lewis take it easy brother Yeah, that would be cool, Joseph. That would be cool. They've been training all week. See if he'll let us get a little closer. Get to the side and kind of 
good with that. Okay. I'm not sure how heat rated this thing yeah. is. This yeah. is not one of the high ends. It's yeah. meant for extreme temp. So yeah. it's, it's not one of those helmet cams yeah. that you know some fireman can yeah. use. <laughs> hey, later on, invest in one of them, and when you go, yeah, one of these put them on somebody. Well, I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm slowly but surely upgrading as I can. You know, building up. It's a Sony Vixia. Um, 800 about 400 bucks something like that um, and then this is just a cell phone pushing it out I mean you can see it's I got it rigged up with a HDMI capture I got HDMI out going into this all right so the new battery is yeah this run this camera as well no so I have I have multiple batteries um, that I can swap out I probably could. Yeah, yeah. I've got I've got a uh, Panasonic that's also got this this one right here. Oh, and yeah. I run mine from there to there. Well, and now the the next one I'm wanting to get. Hey, Eric, what's going on, brother? Uh, the next one I'm wanting to get is about a fourteen hundred dollar yeah. camera. It's a little nice. Yeah. I'll eventually get it. But I can't spend. I kind of well, it's a very expensive hobby yeah, for me right yeah. now. I really can't either. But you know, I got a light. You know, if I need to. Yeah. You know. That's that's a nice. I try uh, not to use it too often. But it's, it's very cheaply done right now. I'm just, you know, starting somewhere and I'll build up Man, as a can. We video deer hunts and my friend of mine, he video killing. You mind? Video. Can I get you on camera? Yeah. Okay. And uh, he uses a 13, an iPhone 13. That's all. We just use iPhones. Well, now this is a, uh, this is a Nord, uh, a OnePlus Nord. Because see, with iPhones, you can't um, you can't get like uh, yeah, it's dark out here. Um, with the iPhones, you can't get external cameras. Right. You can't hook an external yeah. camera because they've got a whole closed system. Right. Out, so. That's why you went with Android. That's why I went with Android. Yep. And so I got a I got a little thing. I just I clip it up on my um, you know looking out and driving yeah. I mean you can see um, like at the bottom see I can change this text for wherever I am it's got my logo on it and, and all that so basically what you see here minus the text is what they see it's pretty neat I mean I'm learning as I go it. I, it ain't always perfect sometimes I get to the scene late and all that but you know but I appreciate you letting me hang out man let me uh I'm gonna end my stream I'm gonna get a card I'll write my phone number on it for you that way you can reach out to me that way. Okay. I'll let you know when it's around. Was that fun? <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm going to uh I'm gonna head back towards the car, y'all. Wasn't that awesome that they let us uh see all of that? That was pretty sweet. Um oh and by the way on the way by I'll show y'all this is where they refill the air tanks. This is one of the air tank trailers here where they refill the air tanks. They're refilling the air tanks now, so just to give you a shot, this is the whole setup here. Um, the uh, police department's right over here in this building, and then there's the fire department. They've got um, two sets of bays. Um, well, two buildings with bays. They've got a total of eight bays. So, um, anyhow, I appreciate y'all hanging out. This was neat. I'd never seen anything like this before. Um, it was cool that they were so open and welcome uh, to let me come and video and take pictures and get in there and all that fun stuff. It was awesome. So, huge thank you to the uh, Alabama Fire College and uh, to the uh, Ardmore Fire Department. Man, this was great. This was absolutely great. So, thank you all so much for hanging out. Um, I'll try to do this again Friday if the weather's permitting. And uh, y'all have a great one. Don't forget to uh, show those first responders some love and some support out there. Y'all have a great one, everybody. Bye-bye.